good morning so as you can tell i've just woken up my face is like a wee bit puffy but i'm just gonna film my morning routine now i really don't want to call this video my morning routine because that was such a thing of the past on youtube to film like morning routines and night routines like no one films them anymore so i don't want to call this my morning routine but what else am I gonna call this here? There isn't really much point in vlogging the whole day whenever all I'm doing is going to the library and that's the way it's gonna be like all week. Like daily vlogs are like quite hard at the minute because they're I'm not doing much. So I just thought let me show you is my morning routine because I love the mornings. Just love the like getting up and like the new start to the day and um yeah. Today's Monday. I was gonna film this yesterday. It was however just such a Sunday. Like it was snowing outside. I brought like my duvet down to the sofa and watched Christmas films and I was like I'm not leaving this spot so I didn't film it. So now I'm filming it today. I don't have uni on a Monday. Like I'm not actually in class so I don't actually have to be anywhere today. So I'm gonna lie in bed for another few minutes. Quarter past eight. I normally get up every day at 8, but if I'm in here at night and I'll get up at 7, I just like to have loads of time so that I'm not like rushing, so I don't have to like roll out of bed. I like to have loads of time so I can lie in bed for literally like half an hour, longer sometimes. I'm gonna chill in my bed for another few minutes and then I'm gonna get up. Okay, first let's make a coffee. I feel like I've shown me making a coffee on here a hundred times, but you're gonna see it one more, so. I feel like actually I should use my coffee machine. Basically I got this here fancy snazzy coffee machine. Not that I don't use it, I do, but I definitely don't use it enough. I mean, it wasn't expensive or anything. I think it was only like 35 pound. And dad was like, oh, when we're in winter, like I'll use this all the time. Like I'll drink hot coffees every day and stuff. And now we're in winter and I still don't drink hot coffee. I just don't really like it. However, I'm gonna use this coffee machine because because you can put it on cold so the coffee that comes out is cold. So I'm just gonna do that there, but with an iced coffee. Okay, let's put my wee pod in. This is the most satisfying noise ever. I don't know if you need to wait for it to go green if you're doing it cold, but I just will anyway. It looks a wee bit watery. Actually, yeah, it's really good. Okay, so I'm gonna sit here and drink this for a bit and then I'll get back up and make breakfast. Normally I take this back up to bed. Actually, I haven't really been making coffee in the morning because I'm gonna go and get a prep. I have one more piece of work due for uni, which is due on Thursday. And it was actually due last Thursday. However, my course literally just, my student reps absolutely pulled through and got the whole course an extension because no one knew what they were doing. And we got like a whole week longer to do it. We were literally all sitting in the library. Well, it's not really the library. It's like another building of the library, but basically all my course go there. So it's where everyone is for me. So obviously it's like a big room. You've computers, you've desks everywhere. We were all sitting. And then we all got the email at exactly the same time. And I just seen everyone packing up their shit, packing up their books, logging off computers. And then we all went to the SU for a drink to celebrate, which was quite wholesome. I want to get that done ASAP because you know, it's just the last thing, like you just want it done, you just want it handed in. My course actually did that before on foundation year. And I remember one day we were in class and we had coursework due the next day and no one had started it. We'd been given the coursework for weeks. No one, like literally no one had started it. And then our lecture was all, so how are you just getting on? Is everyone like done now? And some boy just says, like it was silent and then he was like, yeah, none of us has done it, we need an extension. And they were fuming at us, but they actually had no choice but to give us an extension because no one had it done. I don't think you would get away with that in final year, to be honest. I think they'd be like, tough. I also needed this extension so badly because a few weeks ago, I basically missed a message on my phone. I did not see the message. And it was for probably the most exciting thing, in my opinion, that I'd ever got offered. It was like, such a good opportunity. It was something a wee bit different and I missed the message and then by the time I got back I was no longer allowed to do it and I cried. I cried and cried about this. I was so 
so gutted. I was so annoyed at myself. My sister actually rang me and I, she was ringing me to give off, but then I was crying, so she didn't say anything. Ellen's a bit like a momager, to be honest. She was just like, you need to be more on the ball with things like this here. You can't be letting things like this slip. And I was like, <laughs> I know. And I was so, so gutted. So I did not start this uni work. Like, I left myself very little time to do this because I was like so sad. I didn't have any motivation. I feel like normally I'm really good with dealing with my emotions when it comes to things like that. I'm just like, okay, it wasn't meant to happen. Like, there's a reason it wasn't meant to be. And I do feel like that. However, I'm just so, I was, I'm not now. I was so annoyed at myself for letting, like, for missing the opportunity and stuff. But I'm just manifesting that it's going to come up again and. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, let's make some breakfast. I like to leave it like really long. As you can probably tell before I make breakfast. Like I'm not gonna wake up and have food in my mouth within like 15 minutes, no. Because I'm just not hungry whenever I wake up straight away, which I know is the case for a lot of people. So, but then like people end up skipping breakfast, which I do not recommend. Breakfast, it, we all, it is the most important meal of the day, okay? Like I would never go out without eating breakfast because I would be way too hungry for that there. So yeah, like the earlier I get up and the more time I have to like lie about, then I get hungry and I make something. I'm really trying to get into like eggs for breakfast because obviously they have loads of protein and stuff. I just don't really like eggs. I don't know, I just can't get into them. I also like to have oats and like protein and yogurt. However, I have no protein at the minute so I can't have that either. So I'm just gonna make a bagel today. You know what? I decided that I'm still not actually hungry to have breakfast so I think I'm gonna do like my skincare and stuff and get dressed and then I'll come back down and eat because the thought of eating a big bagel like that now doesn't appeal to me. Okay I want to show you my new skincare tools that I got because I'm fucking obsessed. So I got both of these things and I'm gonna like quickly show how I like to use them. So this one's just been in the freezer. I like to put it in the freezer for like I don't know like five to ten minutes and I use it to like depuff my face and it's so good. So what I like to do is just, oh it's so cold, run it on my face, on like different parts and stuff. Now instead of me showing you movements that I do, I'm going to leave this girl's TikTok on screen. Her name is Caroline Hannaway or something, I'm not sure. I'll leave her on screen because I just basically follow her like way tutorials. She has like every tool possible. She shows you like different ways and stuff. I really like to go over my eyes because that's where my face gets like the most puffy. This is something that I will literally not be able to leave the house. Like I cannot leave the house now without doing this. I literally will get up earlier to spend the time to do this. I do need to purchase a face oil which is going to make it easier to just glide back and forward because I was using like face serums and all and it was just wasting it because I would have to like keep applying it because it would all be going off. Okay. That's another that one. Now I'm gonna go with this one. And this one is my favorite. And again, I just like to take this here and do different motions. If you watch that girl, she will be able to show you a lot better than me. I only recently got these here, so I'm still sort of like learning and trying to work it out. And I do fully believe that this will have like good long-term effects. Like some people are probably like, that's the biggest waste of time ever. Like it's not gonna do anything, but I really do think it will. plans are I'm gonna go to the gym and then I'm gonna come back normally I would just go straight on to the like the library from the gym but but I wouldn't mind coming home to make food because I'm trying to be so good with my diet like I'm really I am doing really really well and stuff and sorry look how much higher this eyebrow looks than this one from doing that um yeah I would, and I'll walk back in it is a bit frustrating because we all know how much I hate walking okay that is my face all sculpted out and <clears throat> now i'm just going to do the rest of my skincare okay i like to curl my eyelashes and that is the height of my makeup Sometimes if I can be bothered, I'll do my eyebrows, but I'm going to the gym. So what's the point? Like I'm just going to sweat them off. Okay, ready to go to the gym. I'm wearing this jumper from Move and my gym set is from Stamina. I've also decided that I'm not going to come back after my workout and like before the library because it's just pointless. Like I never normally do that there because it's such a waste of time. Like I will literally be wasting an hour walking in total. And then whenever I come home, I know I'll just lie on the sofa and sit about and I'll not start any work. <clears throat> Till so much later and, and like yeah I want to make food but to be honest the only reason I was really coming home was because I wanted to like end this video properly and stuff 
but I'm sorry and it will probably end up putting me in a bad mood whenever I get back here and realize I have to walk back in again so we all don't want that also this is my uni bag I washed my tote bag and it's not dry and I have no other bag to bring my books in so this is literally what I'm arriving to the library with that is so embarrassing the library and the gym at that <laughs> It's like literally the most brutal walk ever. It's so icy. Every time I walk past someone, they're like, slide never or I'm slide never and we're just like, mm. just finished my gym session I, I did some cardio and then I did some abs and arms it wasn't really a heavy gym session but I feel so good for going I don't feel the need to make every single gym session like really really heavy and come out in like agony and stuff I'm like as long as I'm doing a bit of movement I feel good but yeah next up now I used to go for a coffee from Pret I mean I'm sure everyone knows about the Pret thing by now that if you pay £20 a month you get five free coffees a day. You also get the first month free and I'm still on the first month however. I definitely think I'm gonna pay for it because see days like this where I'm going to the library. And like if I meal prep, which I normally do, then I don't spend any money. Like I just go in and get coffees on my break. The library's so close to Pret. So if I need like a wee 10, 15 minute break, I'll literally just walk in, get a coffee, walk back and it's the best thing ever. And their coffee's actually really good so. I'm ready to go, thank you. There we thank are. you. Thank you. <laughs> Got my coffee, got a caramel iced latte, obviously. Unfortunately, now I'm heading to the library. I've had literally the best morning. So I think it's like 12 o'clock now. I have no idea what time I'll stay in the library to. I wanna try and get a large chunk of this work done. I would love to go out tonight. Like I'm in such a notion to go out because I didn't go out at the weekend because of the weather. Like it just, I did not have the mental capacity to go out. I mean, it's been snowing all over the UK, but like Newcastle had a full blown storm. So I was like, no. So now I kinda wanna go out, but I'm not gonna be able to. And plus none of my friends are going, I don't think. Okay, I'm actually now in the toilet where I've had to come to end this video. Yeah, that's my morning routine. I pretty much do the exact same thing every single day. But I really hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.